this video, I'm going to be showing you my makeup collection. So I am a college student, meaning that I'm on a budget and I don't really have time to be wearing a lot of makeup. This is my everyday makeup. All I have on is eyebrows and eyelashes and a little bit of concealer under my eyes. Um, so I really don't need... So, um, yeah, I really don't have that much. Um, and if you're in high school or college or you're on a budget, this will be catered to you so you can see, um, so you don't have to feel bad because, you know, we don't have money to be buying like large sums of makeup. So I don't really have that much um, at all, which is fine because I don't really need that much. But yeah, I'm just gonna stop talking now and let's get to it. All right, so I'm starting off by just showing you an overview of my vanity and where I do my makeup. And we'll go ahead and start with this mirror. This is the mirror that I use to do my makeup every single day. You can touch it, the lights come on. I don't really use the lights because I don't need them, I have those. Um, but yeah, I use this mirror because it's really big and I like to see up close. So yeah, I got this from Wish. It was super inexpensive. Um, here's a better look at my vanity up close. We'll start with this drawer set first. Um, just random stuff up there. And the first drawer is all of my everyday makeup. Seriously, this is the only, these are the only products that I use on a daily basis. I have my eyebrow pencil, this is the Benefit Groove Proof. Um, I have all four shades of the Maybelline Fit Me because all of these colors and just mix them and whatever. I use Tarte Shape Tape to clean up my eyebrows because it's very drying so it doesn't look like super greasy under my eyebrows. Um, here's my Duo Lash Glue. I use this mascara to blend my falsies with my real lashes. I have this L'Oreal Beauty Sponge. This is the best beauty sponge that is super cheap. It's even better than Real Techniques, so check it out. And then I have this um, pore filler, which is my primer. The next drawer are my everyday powders. Um, I really only use this. This is the best powder ever. Um, under it, I have LA Girl. Um, these are, that's a blush from Wet n Wild. These are two highlighters that I use frequently. That's another highlighter I love. There's my NYC Sunny Bronzer, my favorite blush, my favorite um, bronzer slash contour, and then another face setting powder. The next drawer is all my lashes. So I wear lashes every single day, and all I use is Idel because they're super cheap. And they range from like wispy to very dramatic. So yeah, it's my last drawer. Then this down here is just all of the random things that I don't really use on a daily basis unless I really like do my makeup. Um, extra concealers, that's what I use to contour, cream contour. Um, I have some glitter liners, there's the Urban Decay glitter liner, better than sex mascara, some other mascaras, brow setting stuff, um, and then black liners. And yeah, just random stuff. All right. Then this area is just my brushes that I use every day. Um, well, technically every day I only use two brushes, but um, if I was to do my makeup, then I use these brushes. And then behind those, I have my little mason jars with these cotton pads, cotton balls, and Q-tips. This little section, it's not really makeup, um, but it is setting sprays and stuff so have face oil nyx dewy honey um primer milani make it last that's just water this is a tart setting spray mac fix plus this is just a cleansing gel but i leave it in there because it looks cute and mario badescu cucumber spray this isn't makeup but it's just lotions and perfumes and moisturizers and all that these are all of my ColourPop lipsticks um i use them frequently and they just look cute on display. And then the first drawer, these are all of like small brushes that I never touch. Second drawer, these are all large brushes that I never touch. Third drawer is my lipstick drawer. I have some chopsticks back there. I have these Maybelline lipsticks, L'Oreal, Baby Lips, lip glosses, just other random lip products. And in the bottom is just random stuff, so it's not even makeup. Okay, and the rest of my makeup is inside this drawer. This little container is all of my foundations. I have several foundations with shades that match me all year round, so that's that. Back here, I have these random products um, that I don't really touch that often. Here's another foundation, it just didn't fit in here. 
I have two primers. I have these powders, contour powder, setting powder, setting powder bronzer, um, setting powder blush. This is an eye cream gel thing. These are two shimmer pigments from L'Oreal, ColourPop highlighter and ColourPop eyeshadow. I have my eyelash curler, some glitter, the Tarte H2O moisturizer, two cream highlighters, an extra Real Technique sponge, some Too Faced glitter, Max paint pot in soft ochre, and ABH dip brow. Next to that, I have some palettes. I do have a lot of palettes, like quite a few palettes. Um, so yeah, I'll just go through them. Here is Lena Lashes Lemonade Highlighter Palette. I have two Tarte Lip Palettes, Kylie Cosmetics Burgundy Palette, ABH Light to Medium Contour Kit, Tardis Pro Glow, that is disgusting, sorry, and the Tardis Pro Palette. I also have a ColourPop um, Lippy Stick set, so it has that, and a cute little mirror. ABH Nicole Guerrero Highlighting Kit. This is the best highlighter kit ever. Too Faced and Nikki Tutorials The Power of Makeup, the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette, and Urban Decay Naked 3. Then in this pile, I just have my um, most favorite palettes, so Urban Decay Naked Heat, ABH Subculture, and Modern Renaissance. Beneath that, BH Cosmetics and Carly Bible, the deluxe um, edition of her palette. My favorite palette of all time, the Jaclyn Hill Palette. Beneath that, I have four more Morphe palettes, so I have the 3502, 35O, 35F, and 35B. And that does it for the drawer. So yeah, guys, that is it for my whole makeup collection. As you could tell, it wasn't a lot, but it was still enough for me, so that's good. Um, hopefully from this video, I gave you a few ideas on how to organize your makeup or what makeup to get. Um, in general, I hope it was helpful and entertaining. If you want, you can check out my dorm tour. I'll have it in the eye right there. And coming soon will be a room tour of my new bedroom. Not new, but new and improved because I moved back home. So yeah, that's about it. Um, hopefully, I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.